Um, really quickly, I am going to do a Europe, what I got in Europe, haul, haul, um, I went to London, um, beginning of January, London and Paris, um, wow, what's this hair doing, and picked up a couple things, um, went with my cousin Holly, and we had the best time, we were there for nine days, and we just had a great time so I'm just gonna start rattling them off here I got a 2012 Olympics t-shirt because the Olympics are gonna be in London it was really cute um, I'll kind of try to group it together we went and saw Phantom of the Opera on the West End got a London Phantom t-shirt it was real cute uh, hit Oxford Street. <laughs> that, was, that was bad. Oh, real quick. And I got a Les Mis. Les Mis t-shirt. Was all Les Mis. Met some of the cast from Les Mis. So they were really nice. I got a I Heart London t-shirt. Because... Let me see my... Ugh, nasty fat. Because you can, you know, you gotta get an I Heart something t-shirt. I went to Dorothy Perkins and got this Love at First Sight t-shirt, absolutely gorgeous, and then I got this kind of, from Dorothy Perkins, this kind of like sweater, it's very like sparkly, absolutely love it. I got a hoodie, I really didn't get that much, I wish I would have gotten more, a London, England zip up jacket the flag got the zip up jacket Paris I just picked up a hoodie that's like the only thing I picked up in, can't really see it Paris that's like the only thing I really picked up in Paris and, oh and a scarf I got this at the Eiffel Tower it's really pretty see it mm. yeah that's the scarf I bought I got some other scarves over there I got this in London it's absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous roses scarf, and then I got this from River Island. I actually bought this because of another YouTuber, um, Tess, went to England and I saw this, and then we walked in. It's funny because we walked into River Island, and I, I like knew what I was looking for. Like I was like, bam! I'll just wear this. <laughs> I wore this like every day. I absolutely loved it. My hair is going to drive people crazy. There we go. I absolutely love it. And now on to a CD I bought. Um, Phantom 25. Had this autograph by um, two of the people that play in it. Some of you might know who they are. If you're a fan of Phantom of the Opera. Here's my program from Phantom. Or... Er, yeah, from Phantom, and then my program from Les Mis. Um, I had, I kind of was dorky and decided that I wanted to get um, a magazine. So I got a Glamour, and look how tiny it is compared to like the regular size Cosmo. Okay. So tiny. And I got a Cosmo over there. Did I get this over there? Yeah. I got the Cosmo and the Glamour train ride from we took the Eurostar from London to Paris and got there under three hours and that train goes super fast and I absolutely loved it we got a bus tours of London's the original tour and Holly will argue with me the color of the bus and I still think it was tan and we went a couple places we mostly walked around London we, like we walked and took 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 we walk and took cabbies, um, so so that was that was really fun. Now on to the good stuff. I look really scary. Now on to the good stuff. Um, me and my friend Abby did kind of a swap, and she got me a set from Sanctuary Spa Covent Garden. It's just minis, but I'm going to tell you something right now. This stuff smells... Oh my gosh. So amazing. Abby, if you're watching, 
full size would be awesome. Um, the body lotion, foam, bath, soak, body scrub, and I'm actually using the body shower gel right now. It smells like tangerines mixed with flowers. It smells like tangerine and flowers. I don't know if that makes sense, but anyway. And she also got me some stuff from Boots Natural Collection. I got some body washes. Cute. And then matching body lotions. So these like you know collection will set fit right away. And now I'm going for the good stuff. This had come out in the States, um, but it's the Scandalized Mascara from Rimmel. And I love everything that is Rimmel. And I'm absolutely in love with this stuff. And I use Benefits, their real mascara. But I'm telling you what, bomb.com right there. I love this stuff. Um, and then I got a Barium Nail Paint. Gonna blur in a little bit and blue it's just blue number two NP 292 Navy 292 Navy says Navy if I read it says Navy okay I got two number seven lipsticks because boots is addicting I've got pink lemonade and star shell and these are in my top 10 lipsticks if you want to see swatches you can watch that video. I got a MUA lip gloss, and this actually doesn't have a name, but it's just the MUA lip gloss. It's a sit down. MUA, and it's really pretty. Really, really pretty. We can't really see it, but it's really bright, but it isn't like the payoff isn't that great. It's not sticky though. And I got a barium lipstick in 153. Let me just swatch this real quick because this is like the freaking over my, over the swatches that I just did. Look at that. Bomb.com. I got that from a coworker. That's because she goes around saying bomb.com all the time. I kind of want to smack her. And then, oh yes. Oh yes two sleek palettes um funny story because I know that I'm like this is gonna be like the longest video ever just on London stuff um I went in and looked and I knew where I wanted these and I got sunset and bad girl so I'll show you sunset this is sunset so freaking pretty let me just show you two swatches here swatch two sunset oh and there they are on my hand right there and there right and then I bought bad girl I'll show you bad girl those are gorgeous and I'll swatch to these look at that freaking color Bam, bam, my hand is like swatch galore, but eyeshadow and lipstick all over myself because I just wipe it on makeup wipe. Yeah, but I got those and I'm absolutely in love with sleek palettes, but I have Bad Girl and Sunset and I want a couple more and then I bought, I can't, this so I'm actually using my phone to, I bought a camera case that says keep calm and carry on and I bought this one in Paris. It's very pretty. And I bought an England cup mug from Starbucks. Um, met some pretty amazing people over there. Um, I can't wait to go back or I can't wait till she comes here. Um, and yeah. I loved everything about I loved everything about England. The people are nice. The food we didn't really eat. This is kind of turning into like a little story about it, but we didn't really eat the first couple of days because the food is so different. Like the first day we were there, we flew, we left Chicago from 
Chicago to Boston, Boston to London Heathrow, and we flew overnight. And, you know, we got there, and it was, like, early in the morning, and we got to the Heathrow Airport, we got our luggage and exchanged our money, and we're just like, we are ready to go home, or get to our flat. Um, cabbie, a car was waiting for us, driving through London, you know, and everything, and from Heathrow to the West De or Westminster is where we were staying, it was quite a bit of drive, like, but it was really funny, because you turned, you walk out of our flat, walk down the road, and you turn, and boom, there's Westminster Abbey and Big Ben, like, it was absolutely amazing, like, actually, right there, <laughs> That's what we saw. That's Westminster Bridge and Big Ben. And that's what we saw pretty much every day. Um, went to shows, went out to eat. Finally, when we did start eating, we had the classic the classic fish and chips and peas or mash. Um, and it was just different. We walked all over, all over um, Paris. We walked all over too. We ate. We were only there for one night. Eiffel Tower, um, I have an Eiffel Tower video up on my YouTube channel of when it lit up. We were up there at the top for sunset and then we came down and it was, started sparkling right at 6 o'clock. And let me see if I have any, no. I got some candy too, mints. They're Everton mints. They taste like, kind of gross. I ate all my Cadbury chocolate because it's Cadbury and it's amazing. Um, but yeah, um, Bubbleology, Bubble Tea, pretty freaking fantastic. But yeah, I can't wait to go back and this video is already 12 minutes, so I probably bored you to death. But yeah, um, if you want to know more about England, I have a blog post on it and I will link it below. So I will see you guys later and thanks for watching.